What's going on, everyone on YouTube? It's your boy, the Memphis XLRA, coming at you live with 100 Days of Yu-Gi-Oh! We're taking a look at a different deck, and I challenge three or more players on the good old YGO Pro with that deck and see how it goes. Today we're playing Evil Eye, which is the archetype based around the Evil Eye Selene. It's got a new Link 2 monster. Figured I'd give it a shot, so let's go ahead, get ourselves started with our three opponents, our three duels, and have ourselves a good old time. Let us begin. All right, your first opponent is Sad Zabuza. Don't be sad. Be glad. We're going to try and go first, and hey, we're going to go first. That's excellent. Although this opening hand is not so excellent, because I need an Evil Eye monster. I got some I got some stoppage, and I got a Regek, so that's always nice. So a little slow. Once I get an Evil Eye monster, uh, specifically like uh, Zariel, he would be the best one. Uh, then it'll be perfect. We're up against Metaphys. And he banished his best cards. How sad for him. So, real quick, I want to give a big old shout-out to my boy, Necrolink Kitty, who's once again loaning me his computer so I can get these videos to you guys. Uh, go ahead and uh, say nice things about Necro in the comments. Do it right now. In fact, go ahead and check out his channel if you prefer. Uh, he's got Pokemon stuff. I'm doing a Pokemon Nuzlocke after this episode's over, so that'll be something cool to try out. I've always wanted to do a Nuzlocke on good old YouTube, I just never had the chance. And now I've got the chance, and I'm going to be doing that Nuzlocke. Alright. I've got my Scythe. He's got Ascension, though. Um, No. You're not allowed. Oh, he is allowed. He's got a Salem Strike. All right. Now he's going to banish Tyrannical Dragon. So now he gets to put that back, and he gets another Metaphys out. He's got Neptes, which gets rid of... Well, I didn't really need Evil Eye Defeat. That was for later. Would have been nice to keep it, but whatever. I don't, know, I don't need it. Aloof Lupine. Oh, boy. That lets him banish another monster. Okay. But like I said, I've got Regek. So that's all I really need. Well, that, I need an Evil Eye monster. At this point, I'll take whoever, but I really want Zarkiel. Hey, Zarkiel! Or Serziel, I got your name wrong. There you are, you little shite. All right. Let's see, now he's going to be banishing some other Nepties. Uh, shuffle it, add another Nepti. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay, all right, let's go. Let's go ahead and summon out Serziel. When he's normal summit, I can add any evil eye I wish. And I'm going to get uh, the familiar, because if I have an evil eye, I can special summon this. Huzzah. And now, I'm going to summon out the new Link 2. <coughs> Pardon me, the queen. It's 100 attack for every evil eye. And I'm going to equip her with the evil eye. So now she's protected from all the stuff. And then I can target an effect monster and negate its effects till the end of the turn. So I'm going to negate Neptes just because. And now my monster will go to 2600. Let's go ahead and do the bottle. Um, honestly, maybe I should have rejected at this point, but it's fine. It's cool. And then next standby is I have to destroy a monster. This guy points to, well, this lady points to, I should say. But nothing's pointing to, uh... Gorgone, so nothing's going to happen in that regard. So, yeah, that's going to happen. I, I got to activate the effect. It's just, oh, hello. I just negate its effects. It's fine. It's fine and cool. And then, do I not gain the fi another 500 points? Or do I got to wait? I believe I have to wait. Yes, I do. Okay, so now I'm at 3,100. I'm bigger than all of his stuff. I've negated the aloof lupine, but I guess I should have waited a little bit there. What can do? Um, and now comes the effect there, and I gotta lose some life points. Because I lose a little bit of life points every time I use this if equip spell. Ouchie. Ouchie. Now I gotta lose more. I'm not gonna lose some attack. He'd normally put me in defense mode, but he can't do that. And he's got that ascension thingy, which I believe. We'll get rid of my equip spell. Um, I gotta activate this. Destroy monster discards. Okay, there we go. There's the mandatory effect that doesn't do anything. No. 
Now I'll gain a few attack points. No. A lot of things that chain. I gotta be careful what I play. Alright. He's got that ascension still, so that's a thing. But I have the Evil Eye Awakening. Since I have Selene, I can summon an Evil Eye from my deck. That will be very powerful. Yes, I would love to summon from the deck. I shall summon... Um... Let me think. Does it really matter? I'm gonna get uh, my familiar, I believe. If I remember correctly... Uh, if you control Evil Eye... I can summon, yeah, I can summon it from the graveyard if need be. That will be useful. Uh, no. So now I'm at 4,200. Normally I would keep that. Hmm. Yeah. Why didn't I put you in attack mode? I don't know. I'm silly. Regardless, I'm going to summon my big Link 3 now. Seems wasteful, but don't worry. I've got my evil ruler. Since I used the monster with 2,600 more attack, his effect makes it so he can attack twice. Hello. Howdy. Uru. Oh, no, I messed up. I messed up a smidge, but it's okay. So I pay a thousand, I get to reset my Selene. So when I get another monster next turn, which I definitely will, that'll be good. Okay, no Ragnarok for you. Although he does get the banished card back. Curse you. I can't believe he had the mention. I mean, I knew he had to mention, but that was my own fault. I, I was my own fault. I shouldn't have done all that. I should have just sat on the 4200 booty. But no, if I was like, I don't want to sit on the 4200 booty forever. I want to summon out more gods. I want, I want to play some more stuff. All right. It's going to keep going off no matter what. And now he gets to, oh, now he's going to banish Lynn. How could you do this to me, man? How could you do this to me? All right. Hmm. This is not the problem. All I need is another Serzial. And I've got so much search for Serzial. And never mind. He's got Ragnarok. So now he just attacks and then I'll lose because he'll summon another. He'll summon a monster from his hand. Or from his deck. Curses. Well, that's a loss, sad to say. I hate starting on a loss, but sometimes that just happens. So I'm going to go to Duel 2, and I'm going to see if I can pick this up. So hang tight, everybody. All right, here our second opponent is Yuya Sama. Yeah, it's one of them fanboys. I know like. I know like you the fanboys. All right, what are we up against? Um, well, I suppose it's something. I got the field spell. When activated, I get my Serzial, which is a good, it's a, it's a start, it's a start. I've got Serzial, which will get me my equip spell that's all important. Ah, uh, where is it? Where is the evil eye? There you are. I need you for things, evil eyeball of doom. Alright, evil eyeball of doom, equip onto that. Uh, banish the evil eye card from the grave. If evil eye attacks, ha, huh, no, no, I think that's, well, that's all we got right now. So basically, I've got Serzil, who's protected. I can blow up a special summon monster. I gotta blow up one of my own cards if I do that during my next standby. That's what the artifacts in this deck are for. We're up against Koash. Which means if he summons blue eyes, I'll be in a smidge of trouble. But because of my field spell, any damage I'll take from one of my battles with this guy will be inflicted to my opponent as well. Um, should I blow up his thing now? Let me think about that. I think I should, actually. And the reason is, I don't want him to have materials for his ritual shokun. That, and I don't want to get Zaborged. That, that's another important thing. If I get Zaborged, that would be bad. Well, good for him, bad for me, basically. And now I will gain attack points. Alright. And I've got my Evil Eye Repose, so that's a good thing. Basically, if my monster attacks his monster, I get to banish that opponent's monster. And that'll be a way to get around Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. Alright. So far... 
We'll see. It's a little touch and go right now. Evil Eye, they can be annoying, but they're a little slow. Little slow to start at times, and that's why we just gotta take our time and keep a going. Next turn. Yeah, okay, he's got the melody of the awakened dragon. Uh, target Evil Eye in the graveyard at your hand, which I don't have. Let's see. Discards in the grave, pay a thousand. Banish Evil Eye spell trap. Yeah, I don't have that. What I've got is my opponent's playing Manju. He's got to play the advanced ritual art. He's going to try and summon a bunch of max dragons. I mean, he's got a chaos form. He's got a maxi dragon. He's got advanced ritual art. There it is. So he can summon at least one, maybe two. Dragon core hexer. Interesting tech. I was expecting a blue eyes, but you could do that too. Is this a tuner? Yes, it is. It is a big tuner. Uh, class form. So now he's going to bring out another one. Uh, let's see. This car using blue eyes. So he Did he use blue eyes? I don't think he did. Hold on. Um, who attacked? Yeah, I thought so. So now if he attacks with this, I can make it so we both take the damage. Yes. And now we will both take damage. There you go. You're taking damage with me. I'm trying to look at your darn graveyard. Let me look at it, you filth. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call you that. Alright, so now... I gotta destroy one of my own cards. So I'm gonna have to destroy... Uh, my field spell... It's not that I wanted to, but because I had to. Alright, now let me look at your graveyard. Uh, let's see. This card's on the field or in the graveyard, so... I think I can blow this up. We'll find out in a moment. Let's start with Repose. So I'm going to banish my field spell, draw another card, and then I get more stuff. I'm at 3100. That's what I am. Uh, let's go ahead and try to regek. See what happens. Okay, so they're both protected. That's fine. It's cool. It's okay. It's great. Let's go ahead and battle into the Chaos Max Dragon. And that way I can use Repose to banish his dragon. There you go. No Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon for you. Um... Target Evil Eye card in the graveyard at your hand. No, I don't have that right now, so I'm just going to have to go and wait for it. So, let's see. Can I target this card card effect? Can't be destroyed by card effects? Yes. So, that's the thing. He's got alternative dragon. Uh, can I destroy any monster or just... No. No. I don't have to worry about that, because that's... That's nothing. It's nothing. He can't destroy me with this. He can't destroy my spells. All he can do is have that thing on the board. What'll it do? Who knows? I've got a ghost ogre in case he tries anything funny. So, so far, all right. We're certainly, certainly a go up from the last duel, so that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Okay. What are you going to do? You should have used blue eyes, my man. Alternative boy only counts as blue eyes in the hand of the grave. Right? Uh... Oh, on the field or in the grave. Yes, so if it counted in the hand, I'd be in trouble because he could use Maxi Boy's effects to put me in defense, but he can't do that. So now he's thinking. He's thinking. I've got this artifact if I ever need it. Artifact Sanctum. Summon out of Scythe. Lock my opponent out of extra deck. Doesn't work against this deck, but it works against other things. All right. Cypher Dragon. You know what? No. Go away. I'm going to blow up your thing right now. No. And then he surrendered. Because he knew he didn't stand a chance. All right. Come back against Blue Eyes Chaos Maxi Dragon. All right. I'm not going to I'm not gonna loud myself too much. We got one more duel. Let's go for it. All right. Third and final opponent is Valar Morglus. Interesting name. We are getting a go first again, so that's nice. I'd like to show off my big lady one more time, and I think I'm actually going to be able to do the big lady one more time. And I got two evil eyes, Celine, so that's nice. 
It's always nice when you start with two of them. Two is even better. All right, let's summon this thing. Let's see. Is it once return during main phase an evil eye spell trap from a deck to grave? Why not? Let's thin. Let's thin deck a little bit. Uh, what do I want to get rid of? Uh, I'm just gonna get rid of evil eye defeat just to say that I will not be defeated. That is my thought process for that choice. Let's go ahead and summon the queen of the evil eyes. And then I'm going to equip her with the equip spell. Huzzah. There you go. I've got the equip spell on her. And I've got something to negate the searching. So that's a good thing. Like I've always said, I don't usually like playing the Ash Blossom. But for today, I am playing some Ash Blossom. But I've also got some Ghost Ogres as well. So now my question is, my dude. What are you going to do about it? Because I can target an effect monster and negate it. I've got a thing that stops the searching. Uh, you can't destroy me, monster. I'm 2200. What can you even do? Destroy this. Oh, I guess it would be nice if he could do that. Uh, no, no, no. Pot of desires for you. That should not be allowed. Nope. Nope. There should be none. You have banished 10 of your cards for nothing. Nothing at all. Granted, he might have actually preferred that because now he's going to terraform. Oh, he's playing Tenyi. Interesting. Very interesting. I have played Tenyi before, and I know how they work. I know how those work. Uh, he doesn't have much to stop me. He has the dark one that can bounce this. I know that. And he's going to try and do that. If he goes for the Link 2, I can negate its effects. So that's just something I can do. Might be the thing that saves me, depending on what he's doing. I mean, right now he just has Munira. Alright. Let's see. Negate activation. Yeah, he's got the Warrior Monk of Tenyi. He's got Nahara. And the target's face up, not effect my Okay, so I can do that. Okay, okay. I've got an idea. I've got a plan. I've got a thing that's a plan that's an idea that can lead me to victory. And that is, wait for this thing to show up. And then wait for him to use its effects. Go, oh, yeah. Negated. So now I'll get power. And now you won't be able to do the more stuff. Because this is an effect monster. Meaning you can't do your stuff. I mean, yeah, you can try that, but it won't work. I'm sorry, my dude. You're negated. You are negate. I know how ten years work. I'm sorry. I just I know how you work. I know your pl ah. What the heck is that? Adhara. Oh, I guess he normal summoned that. Shoot. I don't remember this one. Adhara. Target a banished worm. Add it to the hand. I guess I didn't use that one last time because... I don't know. There must have been a good reason I didn't use that last time. Probably because it's less useful, but it's still a thing you can do. Is it a tuner? Oh, you're the level one tuner of the ten years. Okay. Last time I was doing other stuff. Alright, Nahada's gonna make me weak. Till the end of this turn, I will be weaker. Okay. Yeah. Let's see. Can I target any card? No, it has to be an effect monster. Negate its effects. Destroy a monster this card points to. There are none. There are none. Each time you activate the equip monster's effect, or you activate another evil eye spell trap card, the equip monster. Okay. I've got ideas. I gotta get over that Nahada first. Once I can get over Nahada, I'll be good. Basically, what I'm gonna have to do, hopefully, get something nice. Well, the spell trap is activated. Yeah, I got an automatic negate. Alright, so now I'm going to lose some life points. And he is going to... I, I got to bait out the Nahada. If I don't do that, he's going to kick my butt. He's going to kick my butt if I don't. He'll just do Nahada, I know. But I have no choice but to go for it. Because if I don't go for it, he's going to destroy me. Uh, luckily, he doesn't have anything past Nahada, so after Nahada, it's all going to be downhill for him, uphill for me, or, wait, I'm thinking I'm getting that wrong. Good for me, bad for him. Because while he has the Savage Ogre, 
it's not going to be much once this thing gets its attack points back. Because my monster is bigger. My monster is bigger and better. That's right. All right. So I'm going to take some damage. It's okay. It's okay, and it's all good, and it's all okay. Okay. So now what has he got? One good thing. I've got the thing that negates any spell trap, so... If he tries to blow up my evil eye with some, ah, he had another hot na hot eye. You, you really should have waited on that, my dude. You should have. Oh, wait, are you summoning that? Uh, from hand or grave? Hmm. Ah, uh, no, I don't need to negate your effects. I don't think. Are you gonna try and link again? That would be a very bad idea. Oh wait, you can link that, right? But I, oh wait, I, I was about to say I could blow that up because of the field spell, I can't. I was like, hey, you're making weird moves. But now I'm like, okay, he's actually not making the worst of moves. Uh, I would have waited on that Nahada until my turn, though, because that would have been the smartest move. That would have been the smartest move, my dude. Because now you have no Nahada. No Nahadas at all. So now... Yes, I'm taking the most damage. I have the fewer life points, but I have the better board. All right. So he's got the warrior monk. He's got this. So what was it? Put on special summons an effect monster. Okay, I don't have any effect monsters at the moment. Uh, let's go ahead and battle. I'm just going to battle and get rid of the fierce ogre. It's what we can do, and that's what I'm going to do. Is it, he's not protected from battle. He's protected from me targeting his stuff, but I don't. I can't target his non-effect monsters anyway. <coughs> oh, and he doesn't have the water one either. Um, I'm gonna set this. I'm gonna set this ghost ogre, not because I want any defense, but because if I draw another evil eye, I might be able to synchro summon or something. I put a few tuners in here just because I was running all these tuners. So, we'll see how that goes. Again, I have my Evil Eye Retribution. My monster's bigger than all of his monsters. He got Anja. So now, he's probably going to get out in a harder. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. Troll face up. Special summon and a Tenyi, except for itself. Okay, you got the dark one. Alright. Target a card, punk controls, return it to the hand. I figured as much. But it's not a quickie. So if you make the link, then... I don't, what are you trying to do? He's trying something, but I'm trying to figure out what the heck he's trying to do at the same time. Like, what is this? What are these? Hand of grip, yeah. Yeah, but you have nothing to discard to use the link to. He probably has some other link, too, that he's thinking will help him. I don't know what exactly he's thinking, but he's got something. <coughs> Ooh, I keep coughing. Okay. Okay, he just wanted some defense. Okay, that's that works, too. Okay, that works, too. All righty. Now we're getting into some heat. Let's go for our Sergio. Sergio lets me get another monster. No, not yet. Okay, let's get the field spell, actually. I feel the field spell would help me the most. And... Mm, let's go ahead, field spell. Let me get another evil eye monster. No. Yes. Yes, I would like a monster. Thank you. I'm going to get another Surzeal, so I have that for next turn. Uh, I'm going to get some more attack points and lose some life points, which is not ideal. Um... Yeah, let's go for the big boss monster now. I think I've lost enough life points that it's a good idea to do that now. I've got this guy who can attack twice now because I used a monster with 2,600 or more attack points. And yes, I did let him draw some cards, but it's not a problem. I have another evil eye. I have another evil eye, so I'm all good. All good in the hood. All right, and I don't need the other evil eye back. So, I'm going to attack a few times. Uh, let's see, what was it? This card is equipped. I target a card, punk controls, destroy it. I'm just going to attack. No, not yet. I could blow up some stuff, but I'll save that for later. Please tell me you don't. You do not have a Nahada again, do you? 
He could have the water one, though. If he had the water one, I'd also be in trouble. I'd be in some trouble there, lads. All right. You're dead. <gasps> no, no, he did not have the water one. Good. No. Gotta be careful at this point. I can use my monster's effects and boost my power, but I have very low life points. Another crux of the uh, evil eye playstyle. Should have considered some sort of uh, some uh, what you call it, life points regains. I'm just gonna end my turn. I I, I want to save my life points. I only got what four shots with this before I'm dead. I need to save that for blowing up troublesome links like the Link 2 or something. Got me Ghost Ogre. I can still do that Synchro Summoning next turn. Each time. Okay. World Legacy Succession. I ain't gonna try and use my Link Arrows, are you, boy? Oh, well, that's I know. I'm gonna play my Evil Eye Retribution and negate your thing. Of course, now I'm going to lose life points, but I'm going to get attack points. All right, now what? Now you've got the water one, okay? So you're going to summon that? Going to summon that because you have no effect monsters? Is that your plan? Well, I'm going to say go away. No water one for you. I'm going to get more attack points. All right. So now I have enough attack points to win this duel. Question is, does he have another Tenny Dragon? He did. He did have another Tenny Dragon. Oh boy. Mm. So now he has Tha. All right. This is not the problem. It's not the problem. I refuse. Um. Negate the effect of a monster, mandatory. Yeah, I guess I have to do the mandatory effect. No. And then I lose more life points. Oof. I can only do that one more time, man. So I'm not going to use Sir Zeal's effect. Because if I use Sir Zeal's effect, I will lose. And I don't want to lose after coming this far. Alright, let's synchro Shokun. If I target him, things will happen. I remember the fire one's in the graveyard. The fire one is in the graveyard. Now I have clear wing synchro dragon. The whole duel comes down to this point. See. Oh, wait. It has to be a non effect monster that's destroyed. I think I've got game. Please. At this point, if I lose at this point, it's all my own fault. Come on. Go ahead, Ara. I'm sorry I forgot you before, Adhara. I thought you didn't exist. But now I know. Now we attack for game. Because I have two attacks. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. There you go. There's one. Come on. Come on. What is it waiting for? There's nothing he can activate. There we go. All right. Whew. Oh, my goodness. Ten yees. Who knew how vicious they could be? I knew. I knew. But, yes, Evil Eye, come on on top. Good third duel. End screen now. All right, the Evil Eye, 2019, with the new stuff. Got two out of three wins. We did all right. Slow start, but this is a slow start sort of archetype. So I hope you guys enjoyed, nonetheless. Do let me know in comments what you thought of Evil Eye. Uh, I'll be uh, going now because I got to get Pokemon going, and that's a lot of stuff I got to record. But uh, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, tune in next time for more Yu Gi Oh stuff. Don't know what I'm playing next time, so leave an idea in the comments. Maybe it'll show up in the next episode. Take care, everybody. Your boy Memphis, signing off.